Hi there, this is the story of SoundHound AI. Ticker symbol S O U N. Right now, the market cap is about 6.5 billion, and the price, recent weeks, months, went up to over $16 per share. And the most important question is whether this company, SoundHound AI, is a great investment right now. And the answer, you will find it in this box. During this video, I'll open the box and we'll find the answer here. Now, to understand this answer, you have to look at their business and their opportunity. What's their next steps? How much they can grow from this level? 6.5 billion. So, if you look at the revenue over the last three years, 41 million and 22. 45 million, 84 million, and for the first half of 25, 71 million. So, you see, a high growth rate in their revenue year by year and from 24 to 25 almost a double but still if you compare their current revenue with the current market cap it's still overvalued the market expects a lot from this company sound hound ai some people expect 100 billion in market cap the value of this company they may achieve that, we you never know, but you have to be careful. Now, if you look at their earnings, what do you see? Loss is 22, loss of over 100 million, 23 loss over 80 million, 24 loss over 350 million. And surprise, for the first half of 25, they reported a profit of 55 million. Is this good? Amazing, right? When you see something like this, a growing company, a startup, reporting a profit, this is quite great, great news. But if you check their earnings, go deeper, and look at their real earnings, so real profits. For that, you have to understand accounting. You'll see a change in the value way, the fair value of their liabilities. And because of this, they reported this profit. If you eliminate this change in the fair value of their liabilities, their earnings, final earnings, would have been with minus. So these are fake earnings. They report this way because that's the rule. But real earnings from their business are not 55 million, but a loss of about 100 million. Be aware of this. Now, if you look at their balance sheet, great, they have 230 million in cash. They can cover their expenses, their huge losses, for one year at least. That's good. Now, you also have to understand how they make money and who are their customers. So, Maybe you already know, they make money from subscription, service subscription. They charge fees for their voice AI solution. For instance, they offer smart wordering, answering, and AI agents that involve their voice solution, voice AI solution. And 25%, the other part of the revenue comes from product royalties. Their voice, AI voices, are integrated in hardware. For instance, infotainment systems and so on. Here is more for automotive part industry. And their customers, they say they serve 200 brands around the world. Their customers are restaurants, automotive, this part, product royalty, healthcare, and others, financial services and arts. Now, from what I've searched about their voice AI solution, is that their voice sounds better than Siri and Alexa. Here you have to check it. Be sure. This is what I found so far. To do that, you have to check for yourself by an Alexa device, Siri. Try Siri on your iPhone and compare it with SoundHound AI, their platform. And then you'll see for yourself which one is better. Now, this might be true or not. 
But then you also have to look at the risk, right? Yes, the revenue is growing. But still, the market cap is overvalued. And if you look at the number of shares over the last three years, it has increased from 190 million to over 400 million. So, a double in the last almost four years. As they have more losses and they'll continue to report more losses, this number is likely to increase more in the future. This is bad because you have dilution. This means you're losing value over time if you buy right now. Now, the next question is, how much can the revenue grow in the future from this level? 1 billion revenue? 2 billion? How much? And can they make a profit? Let's say if the revenue goes to 1 billion, can they make a profit? Other question. Can they do that? Here it depends. From what I see, just my own opinion, if they only focus on voice AI solution, I don't think they are able to scale this business that much in the future. But if they start offering other AI agents, other solutions, a combination between voice AI and of course other things, then yes, they can scale their revenue. But if you focus only on their platform, voice AI solution, and then you also look at the competition, not only from Siri and Alexa, but other new competitors, this may be a problem. In the short term, maybe you won't see any problems. They'll continue to grow their revenue, increase more in the future, maybe 200 million, 300 million, 400 million. But then you have to see new competitors and if they can survive, if they can maintain their position to increase the revenue fast pace to report a high growth rate because if the growth rate slows let's say for this year they report 200 million and next year the revenue is flat then you have easily a decline in their market cap by 50 percent be aware of that and that can happen because of competition and then you have to look at their earnings can they make a profit if they deliver 400 million in revenue? Add that question. Because, yes, their platform, LLM, will require more investments in the future to keep up with the competition. And I'm not sure if they're able, I mean, there are low chances to see some profits in the next three years. So, in my view, to open the box and show you the answer, Sound AI right now is not a great investment. There is a huge risk with this company. You might not see it right now. You might not agree with me. I understand that. I respect your opinion. But when I see this small revenue, even if the growth rate is high and no profits and dilution plus competition, this is quite, quite dangerous to get in this company, especially, especially at the current valuation. If the market cap were to be much lower from this level, then yes, you might want to give a chance to SoundHound AI and see how they can perform in the future. But right now, the market expectations are quite, quite high. And for me, it's not a great investment. Now, if you want better investment ideas than SoundHound AI, simply go to my profile, press join, and choose Titan Investor. And there you have access to my portfolio. And by the way, my performance over the last four years has been over 30% a year. Right now, even higher than 30%. May reach 35%. Every time I make a transaction, I will make a new video for you. So you can achieve the same performance as me. Then on top of that, you also get access to an investing course, other in-depth analysis, and bonus access to Spartan and Gladiator, the previous members. So if you want to make real money, high profits, join my membership. Now, there are some people that want to invest in SoundHound AI. And if you give me $1 million and tell me, John, 
you are only allowed to invest in this company, Sound Hound AI, and make a profit. What price would you pay? Well, the answer to that question will be available for members. And to be fair with you, for Spartan members, where the price is lower. By the way, if you join Titan, you also have access to Spartan. So you get both. My portfolio plus my valuation for Soundhound AI. So see you there.